Greetings lords and ladies, Kaiser here and welcome to another episode of our Mountain Blade Gecko Kujo Daimyo Edition Let's Play. Now when last we left off, we had struck and struck, struck, first blood against the Saito clan. We took Ichijodani castle, then bolted through the Saito lands and took Hamamatsu as well. Lord Akahoshi in the meantime has caught up and has already decided to join us, so that is absolutely wonderful. Uh, one thing I did do in between episodes was that I actually hunted down the Hamamatsu patrol because I saw that they were hunting our recruiters and we cannot have that. Another thing I did, I just went to Mikategahara, Maisaka and Kosai, recruited a few more Saito villagers and uh, put them in Hama in, he says, in Hamamatsu as well. Um, I already checked, there's no slaver in Hamamatsu, so we'll just have to keep those few prisoners that we have right now. Those sight on the board, that sight on the body bearer is gonna be very, very valuable. Uh, out of curiosity, how close are we to the next level? <gasps> we are only a thousand two hundred, thousand three hundred, and a little bit more away. No, exactly a thousand three hundred, a little bit less actually. Nice. Skill points, minus two. Huh? We're still waiting for those wounds to get better. Like, I know that I've been taken down a couple more times, but I never... Like, it's been ages since we sustained the last injury. So, the fact that I'm still injured is a little bit upsetting. I'm hoping, I'm really, really hoping that it is not a bug. And that I will actually get back the points that I so... Desperately trying to get early game and actually earned them. I grinded through those melee fights like a madman and the tournaments and whatnot to get those levels up. So I'd, I'd appreciate getting them back. I really would. <laughs> At any rate, guys, in this episode we will continue our onslaught of the enemy. Ah, uh, he. So now it's already three thousand. What the actual? Where even is Ah uh, he? Asahi. He went that far, and he's only targeting our feud. <laughs> Feuds, he says. <laughs> our thieves. Son of a. Good God, I can't wait to completely destroy the Saita. I really can't wait to completely destroy the Saita. Uh, Lord Kita has also decided to join us. Excellent. Lord Iwaki, in the meantime, got defeated somewhere. But he escaped. He managed to escape. So hopefully he actually spawns in Takatenjin Castle, aka the castle that we gave to him. Hopefully. And I like how uh, that Lord just went way past the actual front line. Because he probably knows that I, you know, our main army is going to be located on the actual front line. And he could just freely loot. So dishonorable. Sun Tzu would probably be proud, but that is dishonorable as hell. So Noda Castle first or Nagashino Castle first? I say we go for Nagashino Castle first, and then Noda, and then Yoshida, and then just keep making our way through their lands. Just like that, Iwamura, uh, Iida Castle will also... Like, I say Nagashino, Noda, Yoshida, uh, Okazaki, Joguji, Suemori... Then we bolt. Uh, I'm thinking maybe past Iwamura. Nah, we take Iwamura. Then Ida. Then Nike. Then Komaki. And then Uho. In the meantime, they might try and take Ichijudani Castle back. Like, we have not bumped into any of their armies yet, except for the one that we saw run into uh, Okazaki Castle or Suemori Castle. I can't remember which one it was. Uh, how many lords do they have again? Saito clan. Right. Not sure what I was why I was looking at the diplomacy. Vassals are Lady Amanaka, Lady Ora, Lady Hachinohe. Good god, that's a lot of ladies. Lady Kuroda. Alright, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Did they lose some vassals? I seem to remember they had more than ten. I mean, hell, by now even we have a lovely number of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We're only down one in comparison to the Saito. Interesting. 
All right, so like I said, Nagashino Castle. I'm kind of hoping the Asakura doesn't um, just randomly try and take Noda Castle or Yoshida Castle. I'd appreciate them, I don't know, taking Nagashima, for instance, or Ogaki, maybe even Inabayama. I wouldn't even mind that, but the rest of this is going to be mine, so I swear to God. Nagashino Castle, 104 units. Besiege the castle right away. Sad part is, because of all of these monk rebels, I cannot send a letter to either Hyogonosuke or Musashi or any of our other lords. And none of them are going to say that they have better things to do right now than go to war, because we had an extended... Uh, an extended amount of time of peace. An extended period. That's the word I was looking for. Period. And no, that's not a dirty word. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, lead our units in an assault. Lord Kitsa. There we go. Alright. Everybody's here. Everyone, spread out. Let's do this. One hit, two hits. One hit. Come on out. Coward. I like how I call them cowards, but then like I'm the one always hiding in behind walls and whatnot. Giving commands to our units. Can we actually hit those guys? Yeah, we can. Okay, good. Sometimes I'm still not sure about all of these walls. Thanks to, thanks to, um, Bill. Uh, I mean, layouts such as Yonezawa and whatnot. Like, I'm just, I don't trust these walls. <laughs> Sometimes there's such invisible walls that you can't just cannot shoot through them for whatever reason. Gonna hit that? I didn't. Hit that one though. Hit him again, and come on, come on. One more should do it. There we go. Excellent. All right, hey. Everyone, let's go in. Gunner, sh Gunner should probably not be the first ones going in, but. Where are the enemy units? They're stuck behind the gates, it would seem. Alright, so you guys stay here. Keep shooting, keep shooting, yeah, yeah. Keep shooting. Meanwhile, our infantry and cavalry Go and bust down those gates. Nice. I, I, that, that looked like a headshot, but okay. Well, that one definitely was. I'm out. Um, arrows? And there are a few. I keep wanting to sneeze today. And I know I said that in the last video, but that's because both of these videos are being recorded in bulk. I don't even know if I can say bulk, considering it's like two videos. Uh, come back, come back, come back, come back! Uh, meanwhile, Gunners, please stand a bit closer so that you can actually aim at the guys that are coming out. Mounted number officers got killed. Maybe it was not the best of ideas to actually pull back that way in such a manner. Right, there we go. Skirmishers are doing their work. Ah! That was BS. You were not aiming for me. And we have advanced to level 39. Welcome to the next level. Oh, hell yeah. All right. New enemies are coming. 
Uh, okay, so you guys don't have to stand so far apart. So... Okay, infantry on that side. I guess cavalry on this side. Meanwhile, gunners just keep wailing. Keep wailing on them. Please get that guy. There you go. There's no telling how long it's gonna take us to gain the next level, but... You know. <laughs> it's fine. What's important is that we got level 39 so that we can take level 24 in Charisma. Even less wages, even more units. Also more morale. That's always a very important part. So are there more enemies coming or not? There are, but there seem to be a lot, and I mean a lot, of skirmishers stuck right over there. So this is gonna still be bloody. Mei Ling! Wow. She's doing business. Uh, I probably shouldn't be standing right here. There we go. They can't even get past the bridge and they're already being shot down. Lovely. How does it feel? Because I know that that's exactly what's waiting for us once we, <laughs> once we try and get through. For a moment there, I thought he was just randomly gonna poke me with a spear. Nobody quoted me on that, please. There's... Gotcha! Okay, I think that's it. Everything else seemed to be skirmishers. So, no, not everyone. Uh, archers, you can stay here, but infantry and cavalry. Let's go, guys. Jesus. As soon as they show their heads, the archers just fire. Alright, now that these guys are already here, we can command the archers. I just don't want the archers to be the first one across. That's the only reason why I commanded them separately. And didn't just say everyone rush in. Yojin Bo killed by train side to spearman. That's okay. He's a mercenary. Okay, I thought for a moment I got shot there. Luckily enough, I didn't. I want to be the first. Love that Warhammer, by the way. I don't know why, but I just wanna wanna see, want to see how much damage that thing can do. Cause I'd love to just smash people with a Warhammer. <laughs> I wish you could actually make custom things in this game, like, and I'm not talking about modding, just, you know, an in-game feature where you can customize the weapon that you got. Either colors or just additional aesthetics. That's one. Yeah, the other one. Excellent. Alright. I do have a few more arrows to fire. Which we shall do. There we go, that's one. He's got the same idea, apparently. These guys. And the idea is good. Get the high ground and just start shooting. No more arrows. Uh, I can pick up two more. Let's see, can we shoot the enemy without actually harming our own guys. Hey, I actually got that one! Hey, hey, hey! Nice. That should be it, right? Three. Come on, two. One. Zero. There we go. Nagashino Castle is ours. Oh, that name just brings back... I can't say memories, I can't say flashbacks. But, um, the knowledge of what happened in this battle. You know, aka just the Takeda getting completely massacred by the Oda. Alright, that's a 45. That actually will be useful for somebody. Can I actually have that? Because the, the one that I have right now, I don't know why, but it just looks ridiculous. I'd much rather just have my entire face covered, if anything. <laughs> Zunari Kabuto. 
Zunari, I suppose. No, no, Zunari. My lord, we have taken Nagashino Castle. Yes, we have, and I wish to defer the appointment. I'm sorry. Uh, I was kind of hoping that Lord Iwaki would actually join us in this battle, but since he got defeated, he's gonna have to retrain some units and whatnot. You are at Nagashino... Right, right, he was all the way in Kyushu when we accepted him into our ranks. Meaning that... Oh god, he had to go through everything to get here, and we are currently, if I'm not mistaken, I'll have to check real quick. Uh, but manage the garrison. Yeah, that's good. That's good. We had oh there were zero prisoners there, right? All right, so this is it from everything that we can actually do Do who he says very lovely voice cracks everywhere um What I want to check factions Otsugawa, I wanted to check our were oh we have recently suffered provocations by the subject of the Uesugi. Alright, so we can actually go to war with them right now, but while we're at war with the Saito, I don't feel like it would be a good idea to literally have a whole army <laughs> just attacking us from behind. So, we should take care of the Saito first. Right, yeah, that's what I wanted to check. We are at war with the Ito clan as well, so he basically had to go through... The Ito clan's lands to get from, well, one of these all the way to here. So it's kind of good that he got defeated in the battle. True that we got a minus one relation with him because of that. But if he actually respawned in Takatenji and Castle, that would be absolutely marvelous. Uh, Alright, next target, Noda Castle. Still no sign of the actual Saito army. Are they... No? Kyoso isn't under siege. Tamaru isn't under siege. Tsu isn't under siege. Imahama isn't under siege. They are not sieging anything. Are they that much in the defensive right now? Did they lose that much units? That many units. That much. Lovely English. Besiege. Battle on the gates. Do it. Wait, 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 Abandon the siege. Lord Kuroda. That's a lord that has over 200 units. Both of these castles actually belong to the same lord, I just realized. Lord Kuroda, where... What is your banner? I don't know why I'm curious. But that... Nagashima Forces is his. So he's gonna respawn there. So if we beat him now, he's not gonna be here for a little while at least. One thing that I do want to do is do this. But would you look at that, because of the skill points being minus one, we cannot increase our leadership. Can this please just be gone? <sighs> Let's go fight Kuroda. Afternoon. Did we get to him in time? Seems to be day still, so that's good. Reinforcements from Toyohashi on the enemy sides. Reinforcements, reinforcements. Jesus Christ, how many reinforcements do you have? Um, those guys are not close enough. What is this? What are these 25 units in there? I can't... Who are you? Excuse me. No, but seriously, what? Aha! Uh -huh. Lord Kinugasa. Of Otogawa Shogunate. Kinugasa, Kinugasa. I'm, I don't think we like him. I was correct. We do not like him. He is calculating. But is he actually gonna come and help in this battle, maybe? Lord Kinugasa has joined the battle on your side. And this time, the guy did not get any reinforcements from anywhere else, so... I say this only once, surrender or die, let's go. Alrighty, um... Let's just check... All the battlefields. This one's actually much better. Let's go, position, positions, positions guys, positions.
peasant men. Villagers. That's all Kinugasa has right now. I missed. That was not good. Bacho! Got him. And you're next. Gotcha. Very nice shot, whoever that was. Keep shooting, keep shooting. They have 200 units, so it's gonna take a while to actually win this battle. Those are officers, and those are people that we definitely do not want close to our army right now. No! That was... Oh! That was one of ours. Go in, go in, go in. Cavalry, go in. Cavalry. Charge in, help out. But I'm pretty sure that only our Kinugasa contingent is actually being massacred there. No, that was actually an Uesugi Hatsumoto guard getting killed. That's fine, that's fine, that is fine. Nice. Alright, and with that, reset, reset, reset. Cavalry over here. Infantry, or at least what's left of you, right over there. Good god, a lot of our gunners actually got taken down, didn't they? No, no, not really. Why are we fielding less units than they are? That is a legitimate question right now. randomly start going slower, and that's confusing me. <laughs> Come on! Either run or walk! God damn! Really? There we go! Got, sh got shot in the butt! Screw up these guys. So good, so that our units aren't really focusing on the running guys, but actually focusing on the guys that are still incoming. Let's see. Well, we've defeated about half of the enemy army. Or rather, it will be half once this group is done. Done with. Go cavalry. Backline like that. Oh, that's a spear. That's still a spear. Come on. There. If it's just 1v1 and we're not rushing towards them, I'm more or less confident we can take them down. More or less. <laughs> okay, that's it for the first bout. Yatta! Alright, your party gains 7 morale. Hell yes! Uh, hell no. The battlefield that we were just on is just perfect. There we go. Absolutely perfect for us. Cavalry to the side. Let's go! Positions. Mm, our gunners are. Let's tell them to fire at our command. Let's tell them all to aim. Let's have our. There we go. Even the Onabushi start aiming. 
Not all of them actually spawn with bow and arrows, huh? Alright, so... The enemy is slowly coming towards us. Everybody's aiming. This is going to be amazing. And... Oh, hell yes! I mean, not as much death as you would have expected, but yes! I just love the sounds of balls. Come on. I managed to hit one before. How did we... How are we not hitting anything now? Come on! There we go, that's one. But we just hit him, we didn't kill him. Nah. Is this all the enemy can still muster? No real threat whatsoever anymore. Oh, come on, that was... Yeah. Alright, fine. This commander meant to go in. Gunners can keep shooting, I'm absolutely fine with that. They're not gonna shoot at our own units. I'm relatively confident in that. They usually don't fire across my... Your allied units. Considering all that's left is just a few skirmishers and villagers and whatnot, pretty sure there's no threat in us going in, or rather not threat, but no risk in us going in like this. Is he dead? He's dead, alright. We don't really need villagers, I'm sorry. He actually hit my horse with that. And harmed him. You know, I am very fond of my horse. And I resent you hitting him. Battle one. Alright. Last one, I think. That's right. Alright, Lord Kuroda is down. Yep. And he escaped. Alright, well, that's fine. Even if he manages to escape, as long as he's not going to be bothering us for a little while. Right, so that's one lord. So that makes nine possible armies popping up somewhere. Uh, we know for a fact that another army led by Lady Amanaka is currently... Wow, Tempered Naginata. 4322... 44, 23, hello. It's actually better. 46. I'm gonna look dumb again. Just, I, I hate that chin. <laughs> that fence right there, just, ah. But sure. 46, I'll take it. Everything else is mediocre. Yeah, 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 yeah. we do like this horse. We do like this horse. Leave everything else. Alright. So, um, apparently you still have 16 units left, but I don't really want you. We're heading straight back to Nola Castle, taking that as well. That is... Oh, hey. Lord Toyama. Wait a minute. Isn't he the guy that we really like, that we try to recruit into our army? since last meeting overlord relation 8 but he's reputed to be good natured yeah he's definitely the guy that we wanted hojo samurai of the takeda clan you're not a hojo samurai you're a saito samurai if anything 70 yeah, I think, I think that once you invite them once, you just cannot invite them anymore, because no matter what I do, he just doesn't want to talk anymore. Even with a 70 relation with me, you'd think that he would immediately be willing to talk to us, but nope. I mean, I'm gonna hate hitting you, killing you again. Accompanying Lord Toyama. Oh god, Lord Toyama seems to actually be the marshal. Okay, so we need to choose. Do we take Noda Castle immediately, and then rush towards Toyama and however many lords had gathered around him by that time? Or we rush against Toyama immediately, 
which basically makes it almost impossible for the Saito to gather into an actual campaign due to their marshal um, being incapacitated. I kind of want to take Noda Castle first and then go for Lord Toyama, and once we defeat Lord Toyama, just continue taking all of their lands, like literally all of them. Alright, so Noda Castle. Hopefully. Uh, how long will it take you? Nine hours? Alright, so by morning we'll be able to attack. It won't take too, too long. Here. Horses. Just looking if any enemy truce between Otogawa and Chosokaba has expired. That's fine. Wait, it was still dawn, early morning. I believe it's morning now, so it should be fine. We're gonna lead our soldiers in an assault. Oh, another one of these. Alright, well... <laughs> probably starting to feel a little bit repetitive, but hey! It is quite a grindy game. Those paradox titles are. There we go. We're actually getting quite a few kills there. I'm really, really, really hoping we heal these injuries quickly. I just saw the gunner aiming in our general direction. That's why I stepped behind our guy. Come on. Come on, one more. He should be down. He is. I am now in the forefront. I don't like this. Come on! Not gonna sell me your damage further away. Alright, one more. He's down. Oh, he's down. They're still shooting. Ah, there's still people there. God, that's be way too far for me to hit, I think. Yeah, just look at our arrows going. In direction they really shouldn't be going. Further up. Nah. Just let our skirmishers do their thing. Well, there are actually units still in there. Got him. Alright, but now I'm out. Yeah, this is dangerous. This is dangerous, but you gotta risk it for the biscuit. Risk it for the Sembei. Sembei Cracker. They're still just standing there. They're really not rushing towards us. They're being a little bit dumb. Ah, oh, now they're rushing out. Hello. Ready? Fire. I said fire. There we go. More fire. Can you please get him? Go, 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 go. Still two guys there. We seriously didn't get him? I'm really hoping that our archers aren't already out of ammo. Nope, doesn't seem like they are. They were actually still aiming. Sure, let's go through the water. Why not? Can we? Yes, we can. Sally, about a third of the enemy units are dead. Right, archers, right over here, please. Why are there arrows? Did we try shooting them all the way from there? 
This is very nice. Alright. The gate should still be up there, so. The gates are down. Go, 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 everybody. Seriously, thought that these gates. For whatever reason, I thought these gates were gonna be up. Here. Mm, of course, going to go up that tower. Hopefully, not get shot in the meantime. From this side. Nope, good. Or from a top, really. Nagako knocked unconscious. No! Mei Ling knocked unconscious. Damn it. But they were probably the first ones on to the breach, so. Once more onto the breach, my friends. <laughs> you were just both waiting in our stances. <laughs> waiting for the other guy to do something. I don't have that many arrows anymore, but I'm still gonna try and do as much damage as we can. Uh, possibly try not to kill our own guys, but hey, we got a few of them. Tonto, Kizashi... You still had your arrows. I mean, your bow and arrow, so you would expect that the guy would have... Um, his sash of arrows somewhere still on him, but I can't pick him up. Ah, well. Usually it's what the guy is holding last that you can pick up, but sometimes it's just completely random. It might also just be completely random always, and I just always thought that uh, it's not. <laughs> that could also be the case. Alright, two... So Van. Zero dead on our side, 15 on the ally side, but it's fine. Oh, God. Oh, okay. I was like, he's stuck on the other side of this wall or something, and it's just gonna be bugged out. But luckily enough, that was not the case. There we go. Monk rebels, rescued prisoners, now nah, you can stay in there. <laughs> oh, you guys cause way too much trouble across Japan, really. Now that the Iko Iki are gone, you'd expect, you know, since the Iko Iki were always the biggest backers of these rebellions and everything, you'd expect these rebels to be more or less gone, or just have less spawn, uh, have a lesser spawn rate or something, but sure. Oh god, everything is so bad. <laughs> Oh, uh, when you have to pick out of the worst ones. Alright, so leave everything here. Defer the appointment, of course. Continue. Continue. Leave. What's the situation? 52 Tokugawa units. Hello. Alright, so we definitely ride towards Toyama now. Toyama's probably just saying that, you know what, Saito, uh, Great Lord Saito, this is enough. We've already lost literally three castles, a, a town to the Otogawa, whom you declared war upon. And now I have to clean up the mess. That's what I imagine he's thinking. Well, he's not going to be able to. Because we are heading straight for him. Village farmers got attacked by monk rebels. Lovely. All right, so how many? Lord Ando, that's 250. Lord Fuwa and Lord Toyama. So far, three lords are located there. That's another one coming in, so we definitely want to fight these guys before they all gather up. That's right, divide and conquer, just like that. The guy, Lord Fuwa, ran into Okazaki Castle. That is absolutely wonderful, which means that we can actually attack Lord Ando and Toyama 
it's gonna be what 400 versus about 300 I'm pretty confident that we can take him down unless you know we actually get in between them and force them to run separate ways there we go and we can just attack Lord Toyama now um, and essentially incapacitate the Saito for the until the foreseeable future for the foreseeable future Take Yoshida, Okazaki, Jogoji, Suemori, possibly. Have that whole area under our firm control. Then head to Ida, Iwamura, Komaki, Naiki, and finally, Uho. Whose banner is that? Is that Great Lord Saito's banner? I'm just curious. Is that his uh, capital? Great Lord Saito. It's not. Excuse you? Really? Joguji? Oh, Joguji, Iwamura, Inabayama. All three of those are his. He actually gave up Uho to somebody else. And Komaki Castle as well. I'm just out of curious. I don't know why, but I'm just curious who a great lord would give the greatest land to. To Lord Toyama, I mean, he is deserving of it, that's for sure. Controversy 100, excuse you. Renown, quite a lot. Alright, well, at any case, guys, at any rate, sorry. <laughs> Thank you very much for joining me, I have been Kaiser, I will see you guys next time, until then, as always, if you enjoy what I do, please support the channel by clicking the like button, clicking that bell icon, or rather subscribe first, then click the bell icon, so you know when the next videos are up, and most of all, please do consider uh, sharing these videos with like-minded individuals who might like these videos. Thank you very much as always, and I will see you next time, and until then, ad gloriam.